Alrighty, welcome back boys and girls. It's your main math man, Mr. Shane, coming to you live from Mayfield. In this video, we're working on that Wicked Wednesday warm-up, which uh, for the first part, we're going to make sure we're taking the difference of these two squares. So this is kind of uh, what we would be doing if we were solving for a uh, leg of a, of a right triangle. So it says 14 squared minus 7 squared. And so we know this, we know that 14 squared, we can say that's gonna, you know what, let me actually get my uh, Desmos calculator out just in case we have any uh, discrepancies on that. So let me actually have that out. Okay, so let's have what we said, all right, 14, and then we could say squared. So that's going to be 196. So we say 196. And we know that uh, 7 squared is 49. And again, you can type it in exactly how it looks. So we can say this is minus and 7 squared. So it would be equal to 147. So again, we would say this is equal to 147. Again, get used to having those perfect squares for yourself. So again, make sure you're, uh, let me take that away. So again, make sure you're saying, all right, we have 196 minus 49 is 147. All right, for the first one, it says the diagram shows the angles formed by two intersecting lines. So again, it has the vertex as V, and then it has two uh, line segments that go through that point V. And it says, which statement is true for any measure of R, V, S? So let's go ahead and highlight uh, what angle R, V, S is. So we know that it has to go through those points R, V, and S. So some things that we can kind of take away from it already. We know this is a, an acute angle, but we want to try to find, okay, what are some true statements? All right, so we have angle, R, V, S, and we have angle, let's, it says T, V, U. So it says T, V, U. It says, are those complementary angles? Well, do we know the angle measure of R, V, S? And it says for any angle measure, for RVS, well, the, we know complementary means their sum is 90 degrees, and since we don't necessarily know the angle measure for that, those angles, we can't necess necessarily say that is true. So then let's see, okay, let's have our other angles in here. Let's say for angle, all right, I used, let's use uh, blue. All right, so we said for angle, uh, RVS, which is in green, and it says SVT. So let's say SVT. It's saying, okay, those two angles are complementary. That is definitely not true because we know that those add up to 180. Again, notice the straight line that they make for ourselves. And actually, if we see and look, if we still use those same angles, we can actually skip down to the bottom and see, hey, I have angle SVT and my angle uh, RVS. If you combine those two, you know that those make a straight line. Again, I can kind of show it like this. I can say, hey, it makes a straight line along there. And it's saying as long as that as a straight line, we know that this entire angle is 180 degrees. So we're gonna say for this one, again, supplementary angles mean their sum is 180. And so since these two angles added together is 180, we would know that that is true. So only make sure that you're using the facts that are given and you can apply those uh, vocabulary terms that we had from before.